crawlers. Yeah. Ugh, things that go bump in the night. Yeah, nobody wants those inside their house. But this is high season for pests that find their way into your living spaces. And our partner, Adam Helfman of HireItDone.com, shows us how to keep them where they belong outside. You have Mike Bonner stand there and yell at him. Go away, bugs. <laughs> So now that we have great summer weather, you know Michigan people love their outdoors and they love the good weather. However, when it's hot and sunny outside, there's somebody that wants to get in your home. And those are the pests, the rodents, the insects, the flies, the gnats. And today, we're gonna take a walk around this house and I'm gonna give you the do's and don'ts of environmentally friendly pest control. So the first thing you want to do is get on the outside of your house and walk around the perimeter of your house and take a look at each window and door and the frames. And let me show you why. As you can see, this window frame here is caulked in pretty professionally and it's really good and tight. However, when you open the window, you can see in here there's a little bit of wear and tear and in this angle right here, you can tell this is where the insects are going to come into your house. So after you've checked the windows and the doors, you might want to take a look at the brick surrounding it, if you have brick. And what you want to look for is the mortar, because if the mortar chips away and it's got some openings, that's where the insects will come in. And in fact, if you look down here, here's some areas where the mortar is already coming apart, as you can tell. And this is definitely a place where the insects are going to come in. So now that you've checked your mortar, you want to look up. And one of the things you need to look for is the soffits around your house, and let me show you. This looks nice and clean, however, if you can get your finger under here, then you've got a problem. And once you plug these, you gotta look at the rest and take a look at this hole. That's an open invitation. As you continue to walk around the perimeter of your house, you wanna look for exterior penetrations just like this dryer vent. And as you can see, it's caulked pretty well, but the vent itself is broken. And this is a five-star hotel for the birds and the bees. And right next to this is a water spigot. This is notorious for allowing rodents into your house. Another thing you want to do is you want to look for evidence of activity. And we found this wasp nest above one of the windows. And although this is old, that means that this is a prime location for more insects. The last place you need to check is below your deck. Usually it's shaded area and that's where the rodents, the spiders, the wasps, the skunks, the groundhogs, all hide underneath your deck, and that's where they want to stay. And that's why if you find any of the areas we talked about today, you might want to call a professional, because they're going to come out and identify what we told you, and they're also going to provide you with a solution. Well, if you've seen Adam Helfman over, over time on our show, you know he brings great props with him. Today, they're moving. Well, oh, there's, there's something yeah. going on here. There's only one or two of them that are uh, alive yeah. today. So I brought a sample of what a typical pest control company would get rid of around your house. Okay. So just a couple to show here today. Um, right here we have what we have is an earwig. Yeah. That's very common this time of year. Um, we have the dreaded bed bugs. And you I don't see know. those? Oh. They're down. Oh. Yeah. You ever had to worry that? about right that there. on the road? Yeah, yeah so we got the dreaded bed bugs. Ugh. And, uh, you know, everyone needs to get rid of those if they yeah. can. And, of course, right over, let me see here, right over here is a live spider. Okay. And these are the most common pests that people have. And the spiders come in the house because they're looking for other rodents and, and animals and insects. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And so you got to control that. Right. And so if you don't want to do it yourself, you can hire a pro. Like all the bugs in my first apartment. <laughs> all of these, all, right? all the Adam varieties. All. Did, they, did they pay rent? <laughs> <laughs> they need well, see, to. that's the thing when you're in an apartment, sometimes they're not in your place until right. somebody next door. Right. That, that's in, what right? I, that, that was my excuse. Yeah. Right. Have you ever had any really big, big spiders or bugs around? Uh, yeah, ex girlfriend. Take a look behind you. <laughs> Oh! Whoa! <laughs> All right. So, so what about other what about other pesky pets? What about bats in the belfry? What okay, about? Okay. So yeah. So bats. Um, you know, if you hear scratching in the walls. <laughs> You know, bats, they all want to come into where there's warm spaces and there's food. So your house is a great place to go. Yeah. So they're uninvited and you got to do it the humane way. So our pest control companies uh, through Hired Done all 
get rid of the pests the humane way. So it's safe for pets, it's safe for families, it's not real bad. Yeah. I had a squirrel in my house one time. Did you? Woo! That was a rough day. Yeah. Open windows, doors, everything. Did, did you get him out or you I have was to call? Oh, stop it! It's a squirrel in the house! <laughs> Well, okay. Uh, let's talk about what's going on here with HireAndDone.com because there are so many things to think about. You've got specials, right? Yeah, so we have a great special. Um, we have a pest prevention special with our contractor, Pest Easy. Uh, it's a $99 inspection, which is a discount of $40 off, which includes inspections for damage from wildlife. The fee's normally $139, but if you go to HireAndDone.com, and you can get it for $40 less, so it's just $99. Mm, good stuff. Not bad at all. All right, Hire a Dunn will help you find the right contractor, and the service to you is absolutely free. Go to HireAdone.com, and when you register, you'll receive those key questions that you can ask every single contractor before you hire them. And Adam is going to be on uh, our Facebook page again answering questions from you about protecting your home from pests and other contractor questions. That's right after the show. You can join him on our Local 4 Facebook page and he'll be live. We're twins, me and Adam. Yeah, look at that. We share the same barber. <laughs> <laughs> Over to you, Jason Todd.